Welcome to the Cephu support video, testing your site with host file. When the migration of your site to Cephu has been completed, you can use the new site, but not on a designated domain. Before you change your DNS records, it's good to know your site is working properly before your site is visible for others. That is why it's important to test your site thoroughly. You are able to test your site before you change your DNS records by editing your host file. In your host file you can define from which server your computer retrieves a site when you serve to a website in your browser. If you were to enter your domain on your computer right now, you will see the site on the old servers just like other visitors of the site. Because you want to test the site on the servers of Savvy, you want to see the site from that server. You can do this by editing your host file. Once the file has been edited, you will see the site from the Savvy servers, while others are still viewing the site on the old servers. First, you have to look up the IP address of your new site in the Savvy control panel. After this, you open the host file. The file can be found on the C drive in Windows, System32, Drivers, and finally etc. Open the file in a text editor like Notepad as administrator. If you don't open it as an administrator, you might be unable to save the changes made to the file. Mac users can find the host file in the terminal. To open the file, you will need to type the following commands. Your computer will ask for your personal password. The next steps are similar to those of the Windows users. Add a line to the file with the following information. The IP address from the Savvy control panel, the domain without www. and the domain with www. Save the file. It is important to check whether the site is actually showing the site on a new IP address. You can check this in a few different ways. With CDM ping, you can see to which servers your computer is sending and retrieving information from when you search for a site. Type CMD in your search bar in the start menu and open the program. Enter the command ping followed by your domain. You will see the IP address your computer is retrieving information from. When you see the IP address you acquired from Savvy, you successfully edited the host file. Mac users can enter the same command in the terminal to find the same results. If you want to access the live site again, you can delete the line or place a hashtag in front of the line. Don't forget to save the file again. You can also find online tools that will show the IP address in your browser. Another way to see whether you are testing the new site is by checking for the Savvy plugin in the dashboard menu. You can now test the site on the new server. Watch one of our other support videos to complete the entire migration process to Savvy. If you have any questions regarding the video or our hosting services, don't hesitate to contact us or visit our website to view the frequently asked questions.